guys today we're doing a little project and that is removing the baffle on the 2019 model CF250 and just to show you what it looks like when the baffle is in place so as you can see um, the inner circular bit with a small pipe coming out of it that is your baffle and that is what we're going to remove today now the reason why the baffle is there is generally for noise reduction on this particular vehicle uh, the back pressure from the muffler that's normally there is sufficient so um, it is not really necessary but it is there mainly if you live on a small acreage and you want to keep peace with the neighbors uh, that enables you to ride your bike without uh, having you know, noise um, but it does uh, rob you of a little bit of power and also obviously the nice throaty sound of a, of a four-stroke bike is not there. What we're also going to do is our non-scientific method. Uh, so this is our uh, iPhone running the DB application. At the moment you can see we're running, if I be quiet for a second, it's about 23, 24 dB and while I start talking you get up into the 50s. Um, and then what we're going to do after is we're going to remove the baffle on the muffler and we've got the tools ready for the job that you're going to need so looking down we're going to need a drill with about a five mil drill bit you're going to need a two and a half mil allen key and a pair of pliers and that's mainly just to pull out the baffle once the job is complete so what we're going to do now is just we're going to do a quick test where we're going to start the bike so i'm doing this one-handed and running we've, got, we've had the idle turned up a little bit just so you can get a bit of better idea so as you can see we sort of range that 85 to 94 db and we're going to try it with this application, see if it actually is suitable for our test. Um, and then we're going to remove the muffler in a minute. Now we're not going to remove the muffler while we've got you here with us. Let's just switch it off and we'll kind of let you know what needs to be done. So. In the muffler we've got one, two, three, four screws that hold the cover place in place. Then after we remove this piece, the next thing is to drill the two pop rivets that hold this in place. Now what we'll do is we'll hopefully take a couple of photos while we do this process and then uh, edit them into the video. And then we're going to do one more video um, and we'll test it to see how it sounds, what the difference is and if we can get a bit of a different reading on the DB.